there's one there we go oh that feels decent there we go nice there we go what do we got here what do we got here baby come on up here oh that's not a bad one that's what we're after I'm trying to generate some bites today throwing the little small shad bait you know there's a lot of fry and bait bait balls swimming around the water got a bluegill bait tied on and we just man we just had a cold front random storm cold front blow through and i'm seeing a lot of activity regardless even though it's you know the temperatures drop significantly it's probably that last little blast of cold oh i got him hooked in the eye that's not good come here buddy come here let me get this let me get this oh there we go let me delicately pluck this from you here we go that's a nice fatty nice little fatty oh good god wow we're gonna have to do some surgery here on this guy Alrighty guys, sorry about this. Okay. There we go. Haha, <laughs> got it. I'll show you what I'm talking about. A little shad style bait, you know. Bait fish imitator. We're targeting some slightly deeper edges of eelgrass and stuff. Oh my god holy cow holy cow i hope that that transferred onto video that was totally insane totally insane this fish oh my god my bait was literally at the surface right in front of my kayak i was really in to make another cast this fish came screaming out of the depths at it oh my god that scared the whole oh guy that scared the crap out of me that was completely insane. That was completely insane. Man, this must be, this guy is for real today. Holy cow. You hear that drag? That's insane. Oh, we need to land this guy. Oh yeah, that's a decent one. Oh, that's a nice one. Man, that is a nice fish. Come here, buddy. I, I need to get my paws on this guy. I need to get my little bear claws on this guy. Oh, man. Light tackle day. We're out here right now. We're, again, we're still in deeper, attacking deeper edges of eelgrass. And they're, right here in the lake, there's kind of a point that comes out so it's you know and it extends pretty decent ways out in this lake so there's you know a lot of eel grass growing out here oh that's a nice fish that's a nice fish come here buddy oh man we need to let this guy just take his time come on buddy come on buddy let me get you oh wow i Man, when that bite happened, I saw this. I mean, it was happened so quick. It did not seem like this was that big of a fish. It's crazy when you realize how, just how insanely fast these fish can move, you know, no matter how big they are. This is a solid one. This guy is a fatty. Old Tankopotamus. Come here, buddy. Oh, there it is. There we go. Look at that, boy. V. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Look at that bait. I mean, he got all of that bait. It happened so quick. God, that's awesome. Dude, man, look at the belly. That's crazy. I'm, I keep assuming we're in post spawn mode. You know, I'm gonna, like I totally would expect that all these fish have spawned already. It's already starting to warm up down here in Florida, but look at that fat belly. I mean, that, Unless this guy just recovered that quick. That's crazy. There we go. I got that out. Look at that. Oh, man. That was so exciting. <laughs> that was awesome. All right. This guy was tired. Let's 
Let's get her measured real quick, get her back in. Alright, we're in. Mm. Oh, we're definitely, we're 19 and a half. 19 and a half. There's one. What is this guy? Oh, a little baby bass. All right. Little tiny guy. Little tiny guy. Oh, there he is. All right, buddy. I'm going to get you going. Oh, come on. Come on now. Little guy. There's one. There we go. <clears throat> Another decent one, I think. Oh yeah, oh man. This one is not hooked so well. Oh, this one seems pretty darn good. Oh God, here we go. There we go. There we go. Oh man. Come on, baby. I think this guy just has the back hook. These, uh, the hooks on this bait, very small. Very light wire, very finesse. You can see I got my drag set super duper loose. We're in open water. I mean, this fish could bury me in some field grass and probably get out. But you just got to let them play it out, man. That's all you can do. Oh, I gained a little steam. Oh, there we go. See him i see you oh that's a good one that's a good one oh come here big dog no 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 don't do that don't do that come here come here come here come here come here guy oh look at you oh i got you i got you guy oh man nice there we go look at that guy all right these little hooks man they're finesse but they are they're holding up yeah, dude, look at that belly. I'm telling you, man, if these are post spawn fish, they have rebounded rather quickly. We're definitely catching them in spots that we would have caught them in the pre-spawn and, and, you know, same area you would expect to catch them after they spawn. They push out to just deeper grass edges to feed back up and continue on. Man, that is a fat belly. That's a fat belly though. Look at that. Makes me wonder if they've, uh, if they're done, if they're done spawning or there's still more, uh, more to be had. Good God, this hook is, uh, <clears throat> there we go. Sorry. Get this out of your face. Heck yeah. Look at that. That's another good fish. Loving it, man. Had to downsize to make it happen today, but I will. I will stick with it. All right, we are. That's uh, that's 17. Right, if you look at the tail too, see it's kind of rubbed away on the bottom. So that might, you know, that's usually an indication of they've spawned already and their tails all jacked up. Definitely got some weird marks going on. All right, what did I say? 17. Oh, there's one right at the end. Oh, nice. Not a bad one. Heck yeah, guy. <laughs> All righty, guy. What do we got here? Come here, buddy. Seems like a pretty decent one. Yeah, not too bad. Definitely not a bad one. There we go. There we go. Look at that beauty. All right, guy. We're getting something going today. Camera malfunction. We caught a, a smaller one than this just a, a minute ago. Same area. Sticking with it, man. Just throwing this, uh, 
this little shad bait, you know, it's like a golden shiner color. There's plenty of shiners in here, I'm sure. Just tossing it in slightly deeper eelgrass areas. Kind of ticking the grass here and there, getting hung up, but, you know, right in those areas where we're getting bit. Oh, there's one. There we go. Oh, wow. Oh, guy. Holy cow. Look at that. <laughs> oh, man. That. That guy right there. That is a healthy, healthy looking speck. Look at that beauty. Absolutely. Nice. Okay, that is the fun part about jerk baits and you know these smaller shad baits. You can, you know, you'll catch bluegill, you'll catch everything. But that right there, we gotta get a measurement on this on this spec real quick. Let's see how long this bad boy is. I got to know about this guy. Oh well, if we're going to the very tip, very tail tip. Very stretched out tail tip. I'm gonna give him 13 and three quarters inches. Look at that slab. That is a whole handful of black crappie. Absolutely beautiful. I'm gonna let him go. Love to eat you, but too lazy to clean you. There you go, homie. There we go. There we go. What do we got here? Oh, dang it. No, he's still on. He's still on. He's still on. All right. We found uh, some more deeper grass edges, which has been the ticket today. So if my bait's not kind of ticking grass or getting hung up every now and then, we're not getting bit. And uh, kind of had a lull there. Uh, we found some more grass, found some more fish. That's the ticket. All right, come here, buddy. Oh, look at that. There we go. Nice round belly. Look at this healthy fish guy. What do we got here? Oh, another little bass. All right. All right, guys. Heck yeah. Let's see here, guy. Oh, there we go. There's another little guy. Pulling our bait through the eelgrass and it ripped free. And this guy, this guy sucked it up. Oh, there's one. There we go. There we go. Oh, that's a good one. Holy cow. That's a good one. Oh, stay on me. Stay on it. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, good God. That's a good one. That is a good one. Man. Oh, God. Stay out of there. Stay out of there. Oh, don't go in there. Oh, God. This guy. Come on, baby. Come on up. Come on up out of those lily pads. Oh, there it is. 
come here baby oh come here baby nice look at that look at that oh man look at that look at that that's what i'm talking about nice oh god look at that beautiful bass I'll switch colors to this uh this pearl white because we kind of kind of went back through that area of the deeper eelgrass off the point i wanted to make another pass in that area so i switched up you know just grabbed a different color give them a different look and uh nothing really doing over there so i just decided to cruise back and continue fishing around the lake the direction i was going look at that big beauty God, that's a good one. some days it just pays the downsize this is one of those days oh look at that 19 heck yeah There's one. There we go. Oh, that feels like a good one. Oh, that looks like, oh yes, that's another nice one. That's another nice one. Come on, baby, come here. Come here. No jumping. No jumping guy. No jumps. Ah, oh, there we go. All right. Grab it there. Here we go. out of you that's another decent one another chunker Yeesh. extra special shout out to uh, Google weather because without fail they uh, continually underestimate the wind speed that I will be dealing with and uh, no, never fails it's always windier than they say it's gonna be but um you know, we got out here, we persevered. I started, just got after it, man. We fished the windblown side. Um, our big bites really came off that point and the deeper eelgrass that's on that point. But um, just attacked some deeper eelgrass edges, man. Got a lot of bites, had a lot of fun, caught a lot of fish, good times.